Hello, Joe here from Infinity of Tacoma. Today I'm going to tell you about this gorgeous 2018 Tesla Model S. Uh, this is the long range variant, uh, fully charged. You have a little over 300 miles of range, about 310 miles to be exact. Uh, really impressive for electric vehicle. Uh, as far as I know, um, 310 miles is uh, still the top range for any, uh, there's no other non-Tesla that can go 300 miles on a full charge. I know there's some Teslas that can go a little bit more. I think the, t the Model S right now, they can get about 400 miles of range. But if you don't want a Tesla, uh, there's no non-fully electric Tesla, as far as I know, that can go 300 miles on a full charge. So pretty impressive. Uh, and not just as far as range goes, but performance and features and styling. Um, this has actually created quite a little buzz at our store. Obviously, we're an Infinity store and we love the Infinity product, but we have a very diverse uh, used inventory. We have lots of cool cars that we sell uh, in our used inventory, but this uh, Model 3 is actually creating a little buzz. Our service manager drove it home last night. He was just curious uh, how it drove and he was very impressed and he's owned and owns really nice Infinity products as well. Red Sport 400 Q50. He has a brand new uh, QX50 now. Um, and he was really impressed by this Model 3. Me, uh, not only am I trying to sell it at the dealership, uh, I'm the used car manager here, so I'm responsible for marketing the vehicles and purchasing this. I did purchase this f uh, for our store to sell, uh, but I'm also an investor in Tesla, so I've drank the Elon Musk Kool-Aid, so obviously this is a little bit of a biased video, but um, it really is a cool vehicle. Uh, this one uh, has some nice upgrades on it. So let's kind of navigate uh, through the screen. All the information, is pretty much right here at your fingertips. Look at this cool interior. Uh, before, kind of Volvos were kind of the minimalist Scandinavian modern styling, but uh, Tesla takes the cake. I mean, this is sparse, but very elegant and very tastefully designed. Um, it's very quiet. Uh, if you commute, it's a very nice place uh, to spend your commuting time. And this has some features that will make your commute a lot e easier and <clears throat> maybe even make you some money while you're at work in the future. Um, so let's see here, software, that's the important part. So this is a long range variant, 27,691 miles. Uh, the previous owner had called it Red Rover, I think it's a fitting name for it, but you can call your Tesla whatever you want, It'll easily let you change your name. So this has a full self-driving uh, compatibility. Uh, so the previous owner, paid the $7,500 to upgrade us to all the uh, self-driving capabilities. So um, what this means is right now, it is not full self-driving uh, at this time. Uh, Tesla is working on uh, making their vehicles, the ones that are properly equipped, uh, full self-driving as soon as possible. I think it'll be a game-changing uh, game changing when they are able to release the software to allow this. So what this means is the $7,500 that the previous owner paid guarantees that when Tesla comes out with this software, this vehicle has everything it needs uh, to uh, operate the full self-driving software. It has a computer system that can handle the processing power. It has enough cameras. Um, so uh, when this full self-driving software comes out, it will do an over-the-air update and you'll have it. But that is pending, uh, you know, Tesla, you know, perfecting the software and obviously regulatory approval, uh, you know, from, you know, the, the Department of Transportation. So um, pretty cool stuff and it's an expensive upgrade. And then we have the premium connectivity. So this one's grandfathered into it. So the premium connectivity is... Uh, of no charge so it basically has a cellular hotspot inside it so you, you can either connect this to you know wi-fi or it can connect to a uh, cell phone uh, wireless system so normally premium connectivity i think is like ten dollars a month through tesla but this was grandfathered into it so this has premium connectivity for uh the life of the vehicle um and what that means is uh you can get real-time traffic and uh a more detailed imaging in the map. I mean, look at the detail on this map here. It's pretty amazing. There I am. And uh, you also uh, can uh, stream music and stuff uh, at no additional charge. So it's really cool stuff.
Then we have the autopilot. So this has uh, uh, the full autopilot, uh, premium autopilot software. It's got the upgraded wheels, upgraded leather interior. Um, it's got the sentry mode on it. Um, you can play video games. I didn't do this, but you can actually play some driving games and you can use a steering wheel and the brake and the gas to play the video games on the screen. It's pretty cool stuff. And a very uh, detailed backup camera. I mean, the detail of this camera is very crisp. I think it's probably one of the better ones in the business. And I've seen a lot. So that's just kind of scratching the surface of all the cool features you have in this Tesla. Um, you can open the vehicle, but then in the charging port, all through the screen, operate the climate control system. Everything is pretty much controlled uh, through the screen. Um, as far as uh, driving it goes, so there's two ways to drive it. You have a key, it's kind of like a credit card and you just put it right there. And once you do that, it allows you to drive the vehicle. But even better, you can get the Tesla app. And this is important. We actually registered for the Tesla app and we can transfer this over to you when you buy the vehicle. Um, but you can, uh, operate sentry mode it tells you how much range you have uh, software updates and this actually also turns your phone into a key so once you have your phone uh, programmed this vehicle you don't need a key anymore your phone is basically the key uh, it has uh, the smart summon on it so so much cool stuff with this Tesla there's really no other car manufacturer like the Tesla and I think that's why uh, it's such a successful company and why they're selling very well. I mean, I'm starting to see them all over the place. I remember, you know, kind of when they first came out, I'd see a lot when I'd go up to Seattle. Um, I live in Puyallup and now I'm starting to see a lot of them in the Puyallup area. I think another uh, Tesla dealership just opened in Renton. So you don't have to go all the way to Seattle to service them. And then obviously it's not too much to service with an electric motor. It's not anywhere near as complex as a gasoline powered vehicle. So there's a lot less for it to go wrong. And Tesla also has mobile service, so sometimes uh, they can service the vehicle. They'll just have a mobile service come and do repairs or updates to the vehicle while it's at your home or work. And going back to that uh, full self-driving software, so uh, supposedly when that happens, uh, you know, Elon Musk, not me, <laughs> he, he says potentially Tesla's could actually go up in value when this... Uh, software comes out because uh, hypothetically you have the full self-driving software which means the car can drive itself you can be asleep you can work you can be inebriated and the vehicle can drive on its own uh, without any human assistance that's the whole idea about the full self-driving software so if that's the case you can be at work and then while you're at work this Tesla equipped with the full, full self-driving software can go out and Uber for you. So it can go out there and make money uh, as, a, as a driverless taxi cab uh, while you're working. And Elon Musk says that there's potentially Teslas could go up uh, a lot in value if that's the case. But this is all hypotheticals. The full self-driving software is uh, you know, dependent on Tesla being able to develop it and getting it past uh, regulatory, regu regulatory approval uh, with the Department of Transportation. If they can never approve it, then there won't ever be a fully self-driving Tesla, but I'm pretty confident that's going to happen, and I think it's going to happen soon. And for you, you didn't pay the $7,500 for the software upgrade. It's kind of an extra perk with this vehicle that you'll get when you buy it, that the previous owner did, and he ended up trading it in for a different vehicle. And sometimes people do that, especially more affluent people who can afford cars like this. They get bored of it, they want something else. But uh, it is a lot of fun to drive, and it's got cool features and technology. So uh, makes about 258 horsepower, which doesn't sound like a lot of horsepower, but with electric motors, you have your torque almost instantly. So that enables this Tesla to go zero to 16 in a little over five seconds. It is really fast to drive and you have just instant power. It just pushes you back in the seat. It might not be a net, neck snap, uh, snapping acceleration like you'd get like in a P100D, you know, some of the fastest Teslas, but comparing this to a lot of gasoline powered cars, the performance is very impressive. Really is also a beautiful looking automobile on the outside as well. It's a charging port. Uh, there's an excellent 
network of chargers for Tesla. And have a 300 mile range, um, you know, you can charge it at your house. But you know, for me, my car goes about 300 miles and I probably put gas in it maybe once every week or two weeks. So for most people, you know, you, you'll get a lot of range with 300 miles. So you don't have to worry too much about having range anxiety or running out of charge. 300 miles can get you pretty far uh, these days. If you happen to be an out-of-state customer, we have experience selling cars and trucks all over the country. We can help arrange shipping uh, just about anywhere in the U.S. Uh, contact us for more details. We can help you get the vehicle registered and licensed in your home state. And we can get you a shipping quote. And the way taxes work is uh, you're going to pay sales tax if applicable where you live. Not in Washington State, unless you live in Washington State or you have a second residence here. Call us for more details. Thanks for watching this video. Hope to see you soon and have a wonderful day.